Hey Tankers, Bonsai Duck here. Today we have Night Dog 2, aka Night Dog, and his T-34S, the shielded T-34. He's on proc in a standard battle in a tier 5, tier 4 game. So a top tier medium. Or is this a light? This is considered a medium. Yes, okay. And um, he spawned over in the north and looks to be headed over here to the hill, so Night Dog, take it away. Premium tank with a 76 millimeter gun, 110 alpha, 120 penetration. He fires the gold, he's up to 150 millimeters of penetration. Does have some HE, and what is that? That is a 156 with a 38. Not overly fast due to the ex extra uh, armor, but um, this is a little trollish, trollish little tank at times. Can, can give you some funky bounces. Fairly quick firing, 3.16 second gun can't remember if it's fairly derpy i i, I want to say you know it's a shorter barrel smaller tank it probably is a little derpy ish it's 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 designed for close quarters i would say <laughs> all right so we've made it over to the hill we got an m5 steward over there on the tracks trying to light things up your m5 steward is over here well both of your m5 stewards are over here an M5 steward and M5A1 steward. And uh, HE is flying. And that was nice of that guy to just get in your way. I mean, really. And then you get spotted. <laughs> and you guys are just taking the hill. Just taking it. You might as well just push on through. You got a big conglomeration of tanks sitting over on the one line I mean, is it me or has everybody just lost their freak ever loving minds up here all right nice shot into the matilda bp armor not penetrated what do we got there oh there's what is that that's a lux a lux and uh those guys have pushed in hard and are now paying for it Unfortunately, that did not work out well for your team. Oh. You need to hit some of these. There you go. Get the keyhole. And he's down. How about this guy? Oh. T-43 is moving up to T-28. Oh, he fell back. Okay. Our, oh, there's the Matilda. One. Two. You've been spotted because now the machine gun Matilda is going to come back. And he's on fire and gone. Nicely done. Oh, just missed that one. Yeah, we're talking about some major. Oh, I think you had the right lead on him. Oh. All right, he's just moving in on the BT-7. You guys are going to have to do something. Your team has pushed down the 1-2 line. BT-7 and the Lukes are in the dance of death. Ring around the rosy. <laughs> Alright. Did they just kill each other? They did. The Lukes destroyed the BT-7. The BT-7 destroyed the Lukes. Okay. That's an eye for an eye. <laughs> nice shot. On fire. RBFM down. Oh, what's that over there? Can you get a shot on him? Ah. Okay, so they're all piled up into their own little corner over there. Your Stug 3 and your Lukes are taking on their M5A1 Stuart. An Excelsior. VZ FLC. And a BDR. There's the BDR. He was hiding way back there. Seriously? Is it just me or is it lower tier where you get the campy, 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 I'm not going to drive my tank out and get shot. Oh, 
Oh. Man, you're almost point blank. There you go, right into the side of the head. There you go, right into the engine deck. Take a hit from him, and armor not penetrated. And he's down. Uh, that leaves the P and that's it. That is a victory. Well, Night Dog, you get a second class out of that. Bruiser, Arsonist, Fire for Effect, 82,143 in credits, 4,541 in experience. Did 1,401 in damage, got one kill for base XP of 1,044. You fired 29 shots, of those 14 hit, and of those 12 penetrated. I think that speaks to the derpiness of the gun. <laughs> Uh, 348 from 300 meters out, and you assisted with 1,104. Made some decent, made some pretty good credits and some really nice experience. Uh, yeah, I'm not a big fan of the tank, I, you know, but then again, I don't play a lot of the lower tier tanks. Um, the derpiness doesn't work for me. The speed at that tier just doesn't work. I think you, you, you're you smart to not be as aggressive as your other two tanks on the hill there. You did fall back, and that worked out well for you. I think had you gone up there, you, you probably would have been annihilated with them. And, um, you know, just the derpiness of the gun. You had the shots, and, and when, it, when it couldn't hit, it was just, uh, that was it. that was the only reason. But when you did hit, you managed to make some, some really good uh, damage. So, anyway, that's Night Dog 2, a.k.a. Night Dog, and the T-34 shielded on proc in a standard battle. If you liked the video, hit the like button. Keep those videos coming. I greatly appreciate it. Please remember to hit the subscribe button. This is Bonsai Duck out.